Here we have a spinning wheel with every mob from Minecraft on it and whatever it lands on is whatever mob we have to be in Minecraft. Can we beat the dragon? Watch to find out. Subscribe! Okay, so here we have a list of all the mobs from Minecraft, excluding the baby ones. And if we spin this wheel, whatever it lands on is the mob that we have to be in this video. Okay, we have to be a stray. So, we are a stray. And looks this is pretty cool. Oh, fudge, I forgot. We're stray, aren't we? So we take damage. Oh, uh, that's already looking like it's going to be a challenge. But hopefully if we get some wood and um, somehow make it to the water, then hopefully we'll be fine. Charge! Charge! Into the water, run! <sighs> okay, okay, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. We only lost a little bit of health. This is probably one of the hardest things I've ever done, I'm pretty sure. Oh no. Okay, we have our stuff back. So it looks like we'll be traversing in the water. I just realised that it's turned night time, so we can walk freely on here. Oh my god, it's like a party over there. But well, the best part is, so nothing will attack me. I'm just part of the party. Hi guys, nothing sus here, just minding my own business. Okay, I think I'll have to kill cows. I can't for a leather helmet. I can't find anything else. Craft a helmet. I will just collect some hay bales and then we should be gone from here. I love bread. It's so healthy and extremely nutritious. Oh, it turns out there was an iron golem after all. Finally, the iron golem's dead after dying. Um, one, two, a lot of times. Let's just let's just summarize it to that. Wait, how do I exit that? But now we can finally craft our bucket, and oh my god, this is gonna be so great. Okay, I'll just show you what I have to do. So I have to do this to start with, and I have to rapidly place it a few blocks to avoid burning up in sunlight. Okay, now we can make some stone tools, like an axe, a pickaxe, and a sword. Okay, now we've got our tools and torches, we might some of that coal over here. Let's hope that this is a good cave. It was a terrible cave. Okay, we almost died to an enderman, but it's all right. We're still good to go. Let's hope that this cave was better than the last one. Okay, it was even worse than the last one. I feel like my luck is very bad at the moment. This one could be good. Yes, okay, th this is the one. This is the one, because it's so narrow, it has to be the one. Yes, look at this. It literally extends so far in two directions. And yes, there's some iron down here as well. Considering mobs don't actually attack me, this is a much more peaceful mining trip compared to a lot of the others because I can just go in and go out, you know, just grab the stuff I need, then just leave. Yes, first diamond of this video. Is it only one? Only one, definitely. Not like a secret hidden one or something. No, only one. Okay, another diamond. Yes. Yes. Some diamantes. I kid you not, I have literally been searching this whole cave, only found two diamonds. Three diamonds now. Quick 
quickly just craft a shield and into the nether we go and we're in the nether and it looks like we got okayish spawn now we got our gold boots please accept my gift of 27 gold ingots come on pearls i need pearls okay what did we get um, no pearls i mean we can craft a bow so we only have eight arrows it's fine no flipping way oh my god this is so cool we've just found another fortress okay you have eight more attempts to give me some ender pearls or i shall slaughter your face and your family leather so you get it's your fault you didn't give me any ender pearls you only have one and it's all your fault so i'm kind of glad you died no offense anyway obviously because you know time to go into the fortress we're going in this way because it seems the less risky well uh, never mind there's a dead end we're going this way to the risky way first blade of the day it's first blaze dies to my diamond axe hmm. second blaze today Please give me a blaze of like your lot, your friend. Or just give me a soul and nothing else. Diamonds. And some gold. Blaze spawner. Perfect. I said I know I said I was scared of them earlier, but I couldn't find any blazes. I could only find diamonds. So, now I love blaze spawners. Don't want to risk anything, so I'll just drink this fire resistance potion. Okay, so we have nine blaze rods. So what we're going to do is we're going to get out of the fortress. And then we're going to um, head back home, get some more food back in the overworld. And hopefully there are going to be some animals or something. That is exactly what we needed. Okay, I'm just going to go and kill all of them very quickly. <gasps> Village as well. This is the perfect area to spawn, I feel. Okay, so we have 17 diamonds, which is just enough for what we need, which is a chest plate, some leggings, and a sword. After literally like an hour of just searching uh, and killing endermen and stuff, and even finding another uh, fortress, I finally have enough ender pearls because a lot of endermen, it was very boring. But I want to see where these ender eyes lead. Hopefully, this way because there's a lot of water this way. Where did that go? Yes, it did go this way.
about to fight the Ender Dragon. Number two. Kill the dragon now. Go. Okay, now we will finally morph into something cool. Boosh. Um, I'm really cool. I'm like flying. I can walk on water. I'm awesome, you know. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, etc. You know the drill. Um, um, bye. <laughs>